Yeah. Big mic. <sighs> okay, guys, questions for you. Can talk, please. Hi, Jürgen. Um, did you get out of that what you hoped to? I didn't hope to get anything out. I was just, um, I'm, I'm watching um, and I work with it. So obviously it's called wonderful goals. That was all good. Great other chances. That was good. Um, first half, the, the, the high press didn't work pretty well because in, in moments we, we got better and then we, we won the ball high up the pitch, which is so important. Um, but that's why we, we had these situations where, where Leicester could go through with the speed. It's really tricky for the fullbacks in these moments to be in the right position. Um, we start these kind of things slightly in between. Everybody knows that that's not new, another problem. The thing is just the boys around the ball, they have to put real pressure on the ball. That's what we didn't do. The second half much better. I think we realized that immediately. Um, looked better. Um, said it was really important for us to see that because we spend a lot of time with that um, on that and um, yeah in possession again first half looked in moment a moment a bit stiff we were, uh, Curtis and Trent in these moments both sensational footballers and can do that um, when, when we found then Maka between the lines then it was really good and when we speed it, when, when we speeded the game up um, was looked really good in other moments we need to be calm but in some moments we were a bit too calm and the passing was not hard enough and quick enough and, 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 and then in the end not good enough but a lot of good moments it's just um, we we can do better so that's pretty much um, what I'm talking about and um, so I'm absolutely fine the result is top nobody, nobody's injured um, just a few knocks it's, um, atmosphere was top during the game but especially after the game the lab we had afterwards is, uh, was, is, is really special I have to say we now experience a couple of times but it's special what the people are doing here thank you for that um, yeah good day in the office all good did we see in the first half what Alexis plans to bring to this team, both in in possession and out of possession? He seems a very intelligent footballer in terms of finding space, great pass in the build up to the first goal, and then when the press did work in the first half, he was quite often the man responsible for winning it back. Yeah, good player. <laughs> um, and yeah. These things, it needs time. It is even in the season. It's not that you have the first game and it's in the best game of the season. That would be really horrible if that would be the case. So we have to work on it. We work on that. So, but we have a lot of options in in, in the areas and the, the boys. Um, need to show up that's not pressure that's just the situation um, because I think it was clear when we scored first half three goals but second half Cody and, and Dom um, what they made is, uh, is and Louis and Ben to be honest um, that was pretty special and it, it looked really well Harvey as well showed really up and the James on the six is just a joy to watch he never played that position before we put him there and he throws his heart on the pitch and, and to, to fill the role and um, these things are really good Joey looked good today in the position um, and so Joel is just calm on the ball you can see that, that they're stepping in and that, that all helps so we have, we have everybody has still a um, bit of work to do that's absolutely fine tomorrow we have um, in the morning recovery then uh, after that we will have a, a proper proper video meeting where we go through all the things so far um, with shoulder boys goods and bads and then um, in the afternoon, a proper physical session, and then um, we prepare the Bayern game. So, um, you know, uh, with two sessions. So, that's that's it. Um, yeah, it's a preseason game, so um, not the most important thing. And yes, we needed a couple of goalkeeper saves. That's fine. Um, we know why we needed them, um, and that's what we have to work on. And I'm really happy that in the second half it looked the high press looked better because otherwise I would have okay spoke so much about it and then it doesn't work anyway, so that makes no sense. But second half showed okay, we really worked on it, and that's why um, I like that. Uh, Jürgen, good to meet you. I'd like to speak about Darwin Nunes, four goals in three games already, big second season coming up. You talk about giving players time. How important is this second season for Darwin? And your rivals just signed a big player for big money. So what do you have to say to fans in terms of giving players time to settle in? 
Oh, I don't think I have to tell our fans. Um, it's uh, pretty much uh, traditionally or historically the case that um, for us, usually players, especially offensive players, um, besides maybe. Uh, Sometimes it needs more time, that's how it is. And um, I think um, the signs Darwin showed um, were really last season already really good injuries. The, the red card was not helpful really in the, in the start directly. Um, and, and these things, but it's, it's all good. We just have to find together in, 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 different, in different setups. Um, how's that? Uh, they all, they all are a threat. They all are good footballers. The, the ticket into the team will be the readiness for defend. Because you never heard about a team being really successful with a sloppy defending. It will just not happen. So, and that's for Darwin the same like for all other strikers as well. Because I'm, I'm I know about the quality, uh, what they have, and um, they need to do both. Like our other players have to do both as well, defend and being influential in all the offensive uh, situations. So, um, no, but it's good. Here you can see he's a handful still, as there was the speed and the goal is a typical goal, goal scorer um, uh, goal, being there, smelling it and, and finishing it off. Um, in training, he looks really good. He's fit, That's, that helps. So, um, and now two more games and then Chelsea, let's see. Couple more guys, couple more questions. Yeah. Uh, Craig Hannon from the Anfield Draft. Jurgen, you've talked in the past about the fans and the players and you, the manager, collecting moments together. Um, obviously a difficult season last season, but um, we've done a lot of that over the past 70 years. What's your message to fans um, with the season coming up and how can we help you uh, and us achieve more moments together? I think we all we all agree, and I mean, you went us like on the on the acting, <laughs> the active side, playing side, um, that we were not happy with the last season. So, I, but I thought, to be honest, that we went through it quite good. So, after all what we had together, I thought we we really showed the right amount of appreciation and respect for what happened and that other things can happen as well. Life is not like this, it doesn't it barely goes in just one direction. There are always little bumps here and there. Um, and we took that. And now we have to, if you look at the team, um, that's a new team. That's a, there are a lot of, a lot of um, different roles. And I mean, not so much on the pitch as well, but I mean, in the dressing room as well. So um, being ready to give this team a, a, a proper chance uh, would be massively helpful. If we start the season and it's going well, and it's anyway clear it's not going well in moments, then in Bissadia, but if he, if he would still be here, he would still be here. I think everybody knew we have to change things, then you change things, and then maybe it's the wrong changes in the public view and think, ah, oh, not him, but somebody else and stuff like this. It's always like that. But I really, I'm really happy about the situation we are in, that the, that the boys grow into the game again and into the role again. And that's really really special um and good that's how it should be and um, because of an amphibian rap i don't think it was necessary to make a documentary about me but i saw it and i and, and i and i saw it and i thought there were so many people i didn't see for ages uh, talking um who didn't see it the fox shit shovel is a really was a really important tool in my career so um yeah I shall tell you from uh, my family, thank you for that, because they, they were really happy watching it. So, yeah, that's for that. Hi, you guys. I'm Rohin from Babo. Um, in the second half, we saw midfield trio of Dominic, Harvey and McConnell. Uh, will we see more of them playing together in the future? I think it's now a bit early if you speak really about um, um, James uh, um, on the six. I, I just like how he how he took his chance. So uh, Harvey and Dom are, are proper contenders for the positions, definitely. And I think both proved why. And both showed really um, exactly what we what we need in that position. And um, so that's why there's nothing sorted yet. I don't sit here and and, and I know exactly which lineup will play against Chelsea. Why should I? Two preseason games, a lot of things can happen, um, but we will need all of them. And um, a special um, 
especially the, the, really the, the, the young boys took the chance to just to show up. Uh, I told them already um, f few, a week ago or so in, in a dressing room, and I said I saw a lot of young players in my career, but that this group is special. Callum, the desire to play. Um, Mel is a bit longer with us, but he makes big steps every year. Ben, of course, Bobby scored his first goal today. Um, Kwanza grew in the in the in the last years, not only physically as 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 a man as well. So proper centre half, um, yeah. Kumas very very early, but physically already there has all the things you need as a, as a young as a, as a kid and. Um, to become a real player, so the speed, the, the the technique, all that stuff. So that's good, and let's see where where it will lead us to. But if these boys play the main role next season, we will have a problem. So because uh, must they, they they use these boys in moments when it's really going well, and then one here, one there, and they have still time um, and to develop, and we give them that time. There are other players who have to to sort the things for us and. Um, um, yeah, but Dom and Harvey are obviously two of them. We, we, we absolutely count on them, clear. Guys, uh, thank you very much. You'll see more of them and enjoy the week. <laughs> Can't you. wait. Yeah. <laughs> see you. Bye-bye. Thank, thank you. Oh, sorry. Bye. Thanks.